Good morning. So how to get better results in less time. So we've just finished um, morning sessions, um, Marlborough, Chippenham devices, and then more going on. Now we've got Tai Chi on, uh, we've got full body, muscle strength on as well. Now, I want to touch on this though, speaking of which, you know, people showing up today who probably didn't want to show up, whether it's from home, whether it's a studio. And I shared this yesterday. Um, if you're watching, you'll be able to see this. So um, you'll see on there, uh, doing 30% of the workout you set out to do will probably get you 70% of the benefits. And I talked about how you know, the bulk of your results will come from showing up today. Morning, Kaz. And, and this isn't just like a, a random thing to say, but if you think about what I just said about how to get better results while spending less time doing it, it takes quite a lot of time to be perfect. And it also takes quite a lot of time to beat yourself up for not being perfect. It also takes a lot of time to get started again and see results because you're only doing it when you're perfect. And what we actually see is the people who are more consistent get better results. Like I shared something this morning in our story uh, from one of the ladies, Teresa, who's about 30 pounds down and she's loving her one minute workouts, like as part of her day. Is it a 30 minute? No. Does she probably think, oh, will it do anything at some point? Yes, she had those thoughts, those fears. But actually, it's not just exercising for your physical, for the physical benefits, like will this burn enough calories? That That's doing exercise a massive injustice. It's also thinking about the mental health benefits that we get and the knock-on effect that this has. So if you then feel better, maybe you rely less on the dopamine hit from food later. Maybe you sleep better. Maybe you just feel better in general about yourself, about the outlook on life. And that that is kind of a bit intangible, but massively significant to our habits, to our belief, to our sense of achievement, to our happiness, which is all linked to the decisions that we make along the way. So... My challenge to you today is do 30% of the workout that you set out to do because I'll throw some numbers out there, you'll probably get about 70% of the benefits, whether that's mindset related or even calorie burning or even blood sugar level related or even mobility related. So that's my challenge for you today. Hope that helps. Any questions, as always, just let me know and I'll see you soon. Take care.